If legal in your state, I'm going to show you the best keychain knife money can buy. Let's go take a look. Welcome back and thanks for joining Ty the Gun Guy. For custom signs, go to Benchmark Signs and Gifts. Check it out. If you guys could dream it, they could carve it. If you got a gazebo, if you want to put it in the kitchen, you want to put it at the boathouse, these guys will do it for you. Don't forget to use Todd10, T-O-D-D-1-0. You guys will get a 10% discount at checkout. Benchmark signs and gifts. One thing you're going to notice on this keychain, yeah, that's right. It's This is a Kershaw. It is a launch for auto knife. And this thing has been everyday use. As you see, it's on my keychain. I beat the living daylights out of this thing. So the anodized aluminum is definitely getting worn off. Um, it's getting chipped, beat up thing. You can see the clip right there is losing its color there, but it hasn't lost any form or strength on the clip. Uh, as far as the blade is concerned, I keep it sharpened and I really abuse this knife. This has been one of the best everyday knives that I've ever had. It's a really short blade. Uh, I'll get into some specs, but there's my thumb right there. It should be California compliant as far as length or anybody that has stipulations there. Might be like 1.9 or something, but we're going to check that out as far as the blade length and everything. But you just got to make sure that the auto or fully auto uh, knife, so this is not an assisted knife, this is full auto. Press button, just make sure it's legal in your state. I keep that thing clipped on the thinner end of my paracord bracelet and it has never fallen off due to that clip being so tight. All right, see how tight that is? That clip is super tight and it hasn't loosened up. So as far as that, it's not gonna slide off. I'm not gonna lose the knife. So the Kershaw is a 1.9 inch blade and it is upgraded with the CPM 154 blade. The blade is coated with Cerakote and as you see, it's still on there. And like I say, I use the heck out of this for boxes, mail, just about everything I do. I, I use this knife every single day, multiple times a day. I don't think there's been a time in a day when I haven't used it. But as far as the blade goes, I have had no issues with the point wearing, chipping, anything. So there it is in my hand. It's tiny. I mean, it's small. Look at that. It's definitely small overall. Like I said the blade itself is 1.9 inches. The overall length can't be more than probably what, four point something. So the whole knife itself, to give you an idea, it looks that small, even open in my hand. So I got medium, medium, large size hands. You could grab a, enough, right? You can grab enough hold of this. The, uh, the clip helps for your thumb. Actually gives you a real nice place to put your thumb. So that's, or your other finger there. Um, if you have ADD, you sit here and play with that all day long. Just be careful. It does get sharp. Right, there you go. If you can get an auto, it's legal. Check your local laws, your state laws, all that good stuff. And uh, as long as it's legal, pick one up. Uh, I think you can get these things anywhere between 90 bucks and 130 bucks. Hard to say. Everything's expensive these days. It's light. It's sharp. It works. It's got that dagger blade and it just, it's, it's a workhorse. If you're looking for a keychain knife, I highly recommend the Kershaw Launch 4 Series. They have all kinds of different launches, but truly, this dude is awesome, man. Push button, push to open, push to release. Got that nice clip on there and good to go. Stay safe, stay vigilant, and until next time, time to get guys!